Hi guys, it's December 23rd and I have the day off from work and I'm heading out to do my last minute Christmas shopping. I uh, really had hoped I wasn't going to have to go out today and do it, but it's, you know, the story of my life. <clears throat> last minute Sally, last minute Monty, my nickname. But anyways, I thought, you know, yesterday I had posted yesterday morning a video with what I use for my vlogging equipment because a YouTuber had requested that I do that. So um, in the comments, I noticed that somebody had said, hey, not something like it, not bad for a beginner. And it kind of made me think like, wow, you know, um, I am a beginner and I, I don't want to give anyone the false impression. So I'm just a sort of what I call a lifestyle vlogger. I started my YouTube channel way, way back. I think it was 2009. And I started it mainly for real estate. I didn't really think of YouTube much as a community, but rather sort of like as a, a place to deposit my videos that I would then share on my blog or other sources. So the videos I started doing were all real estate related and a little bit of personal family stuff. But over the course of time, my, you know, my interests have changed and while I still talk a lot about real estate, I, I also talk about RVing and camping and sharing the life that I like, the places that I visit, vacations. My husband and I have a motorhome, so I share a lot about that, especially in the season. And also, uh, you know, I'm on a fitness journey. I've been on a fitness journey for a while. I've had some, some failures, some successes. Um, my ketogenic diet, you know, again, failures and successes. And, um, and also, I'm 62 years old, so I'm trying to, you know, work on my skin. I'm trying to um, not stop aging completely, because I know that's impossible and I can't erase the aging, but to try to make it better, to maybe slow it down, stuff like that. I am not a professional vlogger, so I don't have professional gear. And my channel is not sponsored. I'm not paid for my videos. I, you know, I'd love to someday do opinions on products and get compensated, or, you know, or get free products, but, but I'm not there. And um, so, yeah, I just thought I'd clarify that. I am a beginner in that sense. And, you know, I've been on YouTube since 2009, and I've got a ton of videos. I don't even know how many videos. I've got a lot of videos up there. And I just love videoing. My videos have gotten better over the course of time, but it's been a learning experience for me. So I just don't want to give anyone the false impression. I am not an expert. I'm just simply me, Monica, uh, you know, a lifestyle vlogger, and I love vlogging, and um, I share the things that I'm passionate about, and I use whatever equipment I can afford, and at times, you know, it may not be the best. So we've had these house guests for a week, and I have to tell you what, one of my first real, my first real estate job that I ever got, I was there less than a week, and I thought I was going to get fired because my job that day was I was going in on a Saturday morning to open up. Nobody else is going to be in but me and, you know, hopefully some customers. And I got in there, and I went to use the restroom, and there was... The grossest thing in the world, there was a dead mouse floating in the toilet. I totally freaked out. I screamed, I freaked out, I jumped up, I called the owner of the company. I said, you gotta come down here, there's a mouse, there's a mouse, you gotta come get it, it's floating in the toilet. And he was trying to tell me, just scoop it out. He was getting really aggravated. I was like, beyond control. I, I mean, I jumped up on the counter and everything. I was so afraid. So it's really freaky for me to think this last week We've been babysitting these things. Now, they're, they're supposedly gerbils, gerbils, gerbils. I don't know what you call them, but they look like mices to me. There's three of them in there. They're going home today because they're a Christmas gift, believe it or not. But for me, someone who freaks out on critters, that I almost lost a job over not being able to scoop up a dead one. Can you imagine what it's like to see this on my kitchen table every day for a week? So, hey. You know, yeah, so I'm off shopping. Wish me luck. I hope I really conquer everything I need to conquer. And I'm um, going to upload this and um, have a great day. Bye-bye.